Right, well this was Atlas's third flight, with the first flight that actually showed it trying to keep itself upright, but failing to keep itself entirely upright. Right, well what went wrong in the flight? Well in the simulations, I chose to have an apogee of around about 9.8 meters, but I forgot to take into the consideration the vector of the thrust, which means that there will be less thrust directly pushing the vehicle upright. This caused the rocket to hover at around about 1 meter in height and drifting about 9 meters in length from the launch site. Open Rocket does not yet have a simulation for thrust vectoring, and this means that the vectored thrust will not be taken into consideration and it will assume that all of the thrust is constantly propelling the rocket up. After this flight, I decided to put a D12 motor instead of a C6 so that we could gain more altitude and the vectored thrust wouldn't cause any issues. Here is that flight. This flight just simply had a faulty motor which ended up causing a Kato. Atlas is ready to fly again and I am currently working on building my high power level 1 rocket which you can see in the CAD render. If you would like to see what's happening sooner you should check out my Instagram which will be linked in the video description. I do not yet have an outro so goodbye.